Now, your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Welcome back on this Friday morning, Middle Georgia. Again, it's going to be a humid day for us today as well as a relatively cloudy one, but at least it's somewhat cool. It's overall been a cooler week, and soak it in today, folks, because we got more of that heat making a return as we head into tomorrow. First half of the day today is going to be mostly cloudy skies with a few pockets of sunshine. Into the afternoon, we are still going to see heat indices in the low 90s. We'll be back in the upper 90s with those by tomorrow afternoon. So again, enjoy the cooler weather while it's here. Definitely a lot of storms later on today. I already mentioned heavy rain with those, maybe some small hail, a couple of strong wind gusts, and definitely a lot of crowded ground lightning. So we're going to be seeing all of that later on this afternoon and into the early parts of tonight. The mostly cloudy conditions will last till about midnight, and then we should see a lot of that cloud cover break up ahead of tomorrow morning. Although, there's going to be a chance for some low level clouds as well as some fog due to the excess moisture being brought in later this afternoon by all the storms we'll be seeing tomorrow and into much of next week. It's going to be typical summer patterns for us here in middle Georgia. It's going to be a lot more of that sun coming back, scatter clouds, those cloud fields in the afternoon, and those uh, scattered storms in the afternoon and evening hours as well. And that's just, again, typical for what we see around this time of year as we get ready to roll into July. First day of July is today. Here are tomorrow's highs, though, right back into those low 90s, 91 for the high in Macon, hot spots up to 92 in our northeastern county, Sandersville, Millersville, Dublin, some of those. Let's go a quick recap on summertime thunderstorms while we see them so often. The sun heats the surface unevenly, as in, you know, a metal roof on a farm and, or a road is going to get hotter than, say, the grass by the road because, you know, certain surfaces are going to absorb more of that heat. And so you get a bit of an uneven heating at the surface, and so you get a mixing layer of air just above that, and it becomes unstable, and then it will begin to rise up, and that's how you get those cloud fields to develop in the afternoon. Afternoon. Finally, eventually those clouds can't grow anymore and that moisture becomes too much for the updraft to sustain and it falls back down, pulling cooler air with it, which helps to keep things cooler right after we see those storms in the afternoon. Of course, you have to have humid conditions for this to happen. It's going to be plenty humid throughout the next week with dew points staying in the low 70s and upper 60s. And because of all the excess moisture we've had lately, the mosquitoes have come back in force. Extreme mosquito rates throughout the weekend.